Good morning students. Today we are see, going to see the part 2 of exploring continent uh, North America and South America. Here we are going to see the South America. Next to Asia, Africa and North America. South America is the first largest country in the world. Continent actually. The most of the South American continent lies within the Southern Hemisphere and hence called Southern Continent. So location uh, 12 degree la 55 degree latitude layo, 35 to 81 degree longitude layo, there is, the equator zero latitude passes through the mouth of Amazon river. Anala Amazon on the Olokla Nalark, the Tropic of Cab Cabricon uh, that is passed through the Rio de Janeiro in Brazil. The South America is inverted triangular shaped landmass. The area of continent is nearly uh, 17 cross square meter which occupies 12 percent of the world land area. This is uh, South America. Physiography, uh, it has Andes mountain, river basin, uh, central plains and eastern highlands. So nearly they are divided into three. Okay. So this is the Andes mountain. Just like uh, Rocky Mountain, here it is Anti Mountain. The Andes Mountain, uh, the longest mountain range in the world, extends for nearly 6,440 kilometers along the Pacific coast. Okay. Here, Aconaco and exist Valcono in Argentina border, which is reached an evolution of uh, 6,961 meters height. The Andes being a part of Pacific Ring of the Fire, these places are subject to a great volcanic eruption and earthquake activities. Uh, there are some active volcanoes like Cotopaxi that is uh, on the Andes range, 5,991 5, meter height. It is Mount Anakova. This is Cotopaxi. This is a volcano. And the river basin and central plains. Nearly half of the continent is covered by the plain. Uh, three great rivers drain into the Atlantic Ocean. The biggest of them is Amazon. Okay. The Orinoco Basin is separated from the Amazon base by a lower interfluence. It is also one of the most productive part of the continent. Eastern Highland, the, these are the considerable older than Andes and are mainly Platino which is cut by many rivers. They lie to the north and south of Amazon River. The Gunia Highland is located in the northern part of continent which have number of waterfalls including Angel Falls. The climate. The climate of continent of South America has been closely influenced by the latitude, attitude and promiscuity of the Pacific and Atlantic Ocean. It is hot in Amazon Basin and the equator passes through it whereas Quito situated almost on the same latitude and the Andes have external spring. So, where is hot town? Where is the hot Cold hour. Most of the America region have its summer from November to January. The more la hunde May la erko. Inga hunde November to January the summer. When it's quite hot in Brazil, Argentina has relatively cooler climate because of its location in more more southerly latitude. However, the Amazon basin gets rainfall every day because of its equatorial location. The region around the equator get what is called four o'clock rain, which was conventional rain. Rainfall decreases towards the interior. Drainage. Owing to the position of the Andes, all great rivers of the and continent drain into Atlantic. The Pacific streams are short and weep, but along the coastland of Peru, their waters are used for irrigation and to some extent by hydroelectric power. Amazon is the longest river of South America. At the point where it is entered the sea, the river is so wide and powerful that falls even at a distance of 800 km in the high sea. The river Paragua has the Parana. The Uruguay river is the main uh, tributaries which together form the known as the Platy river system. Natural vegetation. There are four main natural vegetation areas of South America and are the Amazon basis, Eastern Highland, Grand Chaco and slo slopes of Andes. The salts of equator region are called lungs of the world. The selvas. The Amazon rainforest has the long, largest of their kind in the world. The other common species are rosewood, Sichinova, the variety of plum trees, bark of chain, Kona trees used for making quinine, the drug to cure malaria. This is the climate region of South America. Wildlife. South America is blessed with variety of wildlife. 
The dense forest swamps the river Amazon basin are particularly rich in different species of animals birds. More than 1500 types of birds are found. Devalarukku 1500 vidamana paravigal. Okay. The forest is home to variety of monkeys. Spider monkey, howlog monkey, owl monkey, squirrel monkeys are very uh, gentle. The anagonda which is the, one of the largest snakes in the world is also found here. The ancient mammals such as Antridius and Armandillos are found in South America. The Lalmals are animal type found only in South America. This is the fightless bird. This is Lamas. Agriculture. More than half of the people of South America live by farming. Agriculture is the main. Vivasa is the main. Most of the areas is covered by forests like Amazon base. Wheat. Uh, main country is Argentina, Brazil, Paraguay, Uruguay and Chile. These are very famous for their wheat. Argentina is the one of the largest producer and exporter of the wheat in the world. Sugarcane, just like North America, here also sugarcane is very famous. Spanish, Portugal introduced sugarcane to the West Indies and Brazil. European the Indian introduced Pandrang, okay. Mice, mice is also known as corn. Mice is grown in the warmer part of the Pampas and coastal region of Brazil. Coffee and cocoa. Coffee and cocoa are the most important crops of South America. These crops need a warm temperature with the frequently rainy rainfall and well drained soil. This is the cocoa. Okay. Cotton. Cotton is another important cash crop for South America. Warm climate with frequent rainfall provide the suitable condition. Barley, ray and oats are the important. In Argentina, Uruguay, Chile, Andrian region, Highland, Bolivia, Ecuador and Peru. Most of the country's words are the important as for the livestock in the field. Animal rearing is important. Uh, they rear beef uh, cattle are raised in Pambas in Argentina. Cattle are mainly raised for the drought purpose and meat. Here most of the cattle are Coralio breed well suited in climate condition. Sheep are reared in dry parts of the South America. Argentina and Uruguay are the important sheep clearing countries. These are the sheep. Fisheries. Peru is one of the world largest producer of the tropical fish. Here the wool, cool humboldt current helps to bring plankton which is the main food for fishes. There are nearly 40 fishing ports. Besides coastal fishing, inland fishing are also carried out in South America. Minerals. South America is rich in mineral. These mineral deposits are unevenly distributed. Iron ore. Iron ore is very important. Brazil and Chile both are massive deposit of iron ore. Brazil has the second largest iron ore deposit in the world. Magnesium. Brazil also large deposit of magnesium. Magnesium ore is mined at La Fonte, Minas, Guerrillas and other north state of Amapa. Petroleum. Venezuela is rich in petroleum deposit. Argentina, Colombia, Ecuador, Peru, Chile, Bolivia are other valuable oil fields. Copper. Chile is the uh, third largest producer of copper in the world. Box, uh, bauxite. Bauxite. Brazil is the third largest bauxite producing country and important bauxite mining center located near the mouth of Amazon River. Industries. Industries in South America have developed slowly. Argentina, Brazil, Chile are the most highly developed industrial countries in this continent. Trade. South America has significant role in world trade. More than half of the South America trade are shared by Brazil, Argentina, Venezuela, Peru and Chile. Transport. Unlike uh, North America, South America still does not have an adequate integrated transport network. North America Mary, nulla transport illa da, but they have nice transport roadways. South America has an extensive and rapidly expanding network of uh, roads in many countries. However, only a relative small percentage of road are paved. This is the roadways. Pan America Highway System, which will extend throughout the Americas. Railways. The most uh, South American countries railway have lost their dominant position of the major mode of transport. Have been replaced by the road network that have developed rapidly since 1960. Most countries have two more track gauges which embeds the efficient integration of railway system. Waterways. 
CWA have long been a virtual component of the transfer system of South America. Majority of imports and export to and from the continent are moved by the ships. This is a cost small down. There are two inland waterway system interna international importance. They are Paraguay, Uruguay Basin and Amazon Basin which includes six countries. Airways. Airways have developed rapidly since World War II. The increase in particularly significant with respect to the passenger traffic also handling bulky flights. Population. So, South America contains world most mixed population. Especially Spanish Portuguese so they are mixing them on the 15th century. They are descendants of Africa, slaves through over brought over for the European. Africa learned the Naria where Adimila Kondon the Valase Chanala, Anglode and the generation now on the Naria age. So North America, South America, Dinale, Naria Africans are Panga to Chalonga. There are three major races from South America are American Indian, European, and Blacks. The current population is this is the current population. Population distribution is highly densely populated by Guinea, Venezuela, Suriname, Colombia, Brazil, and Peru. Moderate populated area is Paraguay, Chile, and Uruguay. Sparely populated area is Argentina, Bolivia, and Amazon basis. Languages and religious. Languages in South America are Dutch, French, English, German, and Hindi. Christianity is the dominant religion in South America. So, thank you, students. We will meet in the next video for book exercise.